It is time for the highs and lows of the week, and our first high goes to the outpouring of support for the state of Kentucky, battered by relentless rain and deadly flooding for the last couple of weeks. The pictures and the stories have been absolutely devastating, with at least 37 people dead and the lives of thousands more turned upside down by the floods. But the people of Kentucky have stepped up for their neighbors. Basketball is king in the state, and the beloved Cats, with some help from their big blue nation of fans, are lending a big hand. The University of Kentucky basketball teams hosted a telethon and open practice on Tuesday night, with 100% of the proceeds, proceeds going to Red Cross flood relief efforts in eastern Kentucky. The three-hour event featured appearances from current and former U.K. athletes. In all, that telethon raised more than $3.3 million. Amazing. Meanwhile, country music superstar and Kentucky favorite son, Chris Stapleton, quietly has been doing his part back home. This week, he was spotted at several cleanup sites and at a Walmart, buying as many supplies as he possibly could. Stapleton even shared a special moment with six-year-old Etta, who has autism. Her mother says Stapleton's music sometimes is the only thing that calms Etta down. He is a good man, and Eastern Kentucky is going to need that support for a long time to come. Our first low goes to the heart-stopping close call for one daredevil in Spain. Kevin Phillip is a professional acro-paraglider. That means he makes his living doing freestyle flips and tricks while falling from the sky in one of the most extreme sports in the world. On a recent turbulent day, Phillip's chute did not open after his lines tangled mid-flip and he got twisted up in the wing, quickly increasing his speed as he hurtled toward the ground. Harrowing video of the incident shot from a 360-degree camera and his helmet and on the ground shows Philip frantically trying to gain control of that tangled mess. With seconds to spare, he makes one last desperate reach for a rescue parachute, which deploys just in time. Philip told NBC News, despite what we saw in that dramatic video, he was, quote, surprisingly calm. Well, I'm glad Kevin was calm because the rest of us are a mess over here. Glad he's okay. Our final low goes to the frustrating lack of beauty products based on the wing sauces of popular restaurant chains. Well, Applebee's finally is doing something about it. Applebee's has teamed up with beauty brand Winky Lux to launch Saucy Gloss, that is lip gloss that comes in four spicy flavors of the restaurant's wing sauce. Get Me Hot Buffalo is described as a creamy coral that packs the hot buffalo spice your ex could never have handled, okay? Sweet Chili Kiss features a hint of fine golden chili specks that, in the words of Applebee's, put the mmm in makeout. I can't believe I'm saying this. Be My Honey Pepper promises to make you the queen bee of date night. And Honey Barbecue Tea, which we're told makes your kisses downright craveable. And just wait until you try Applebee's Broccoli Chicken Alfredo Cologne. A joke, but you know they thought about it. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.